my name is Aaron Eckblad. I'm from Windsor, Ontario. Hi, my name is Connor McDavid. I play for the Toronto Marlies. Hi, I'm Sam Bennett. I play for the Toronto Marlies. Bo Horvat, uh, Elgin Middle Six Chiefs from Rodney, Ontario. Hi, I'm Josh Hosang. I'm from uh, Thornhill, Ontario. Michael Del Pool, Vaughn Kings, number 91. I'm Travis Connectney. I'm a center for the Elgin Middle Six Chiefs, and I grew up in Bothwell, Ontario. Hi, my name is Jacob Chickren. I'm defense for the Toronto Junior Canadians. I'm Nicholas Ritchie. I play right wing, Toronto Marlies, and I'm from Orangeville. My name is David Lennon. I'm playing for Diamond Flyers, right wing, number 71. The Saginaw Spirit are very pleased to select with their first round selection Brady Gilmore, Quinty. Brady Gilmore out of Quinty, the choice of the Saginaw Spirit. Quinty, we're talking about the Belleville region, that surrounding area, and Brady Gilmore, a player who uh, a lot of people certainly had on the radar right from the start of the season. Yeah, he's a complete player. You know, he makes all his line mates better. He's he probably arguably the best playmaker in the draft. He makes some, some plays that watching from the stands that I don't see, you know, and he was making them happen. Just a complete player, plays 200 feet, just the kind of kid you, you're going to win a championship with. And Brady is certainly a guy, as we're seeing some video of him there, able to do a lot with the puck, Tim. And we see a player like that who's got that pretty solid size, that pretty solid captain of his team as well. Yeah. That shows right off the bat it's a player that hoped to develop into something big. Yeah, you know, the one thing you notice with Brady is his, his hockey IQ. I mean, he's, he's always a step ahead of the game, and he's never chasing the game. He, he always seems to know what's going on in the ice. And, that's stuff you can't teach. Hi, my name is Brady Gilmore. I play for the Quinney Red Devils, and uh, I'm a centerman. Uh, I like to think that I'm more of a playmaker. I've been told I play like Logan Couture, kind of play 200 feet, and uh, pretty good in the offensive zone. So what's the strongest part of your game, then? Uh, I'd say the strongest part of my game is probably my vision and the way I see the ice and uh, anticipate what's going to happen. Uh, also, I like to prod myself on being able to play 200 feet. Now you recently had a chance to represent Ontario at the Canada Winter Games. You brought back a gold medal. What was that experience like? Oh, that was an unbelievable experience. Uh, something I'll never forget. It was the coolest thing I've ever done. It was really awesome. They just treated us so well there. It was so cool. All the guys came so close together, came, came brothers. It was an awesome experience. Now I'm sure you've had a chance to uh, see some OHL games in the past. Uh, what do you think it's going to be like when you get to suit up and play in an OHL game? Uh, I think the uh, biggest difference would probably be uh, just how fast it is, how big the guys are, and uh, just how much time you have to make a play, and uh, yeah, stuff like that. But I'm not too sure. Uh, hopefully, I get to, hopefully, I get to find out. The Saginaw Spirit is pleased to select with their second round selection, Robert Croner, Toronto Titans. The voice of Jim Palafito, the general manager of the Saginaw Spirit, making that choice. And uh, Toronto Titans, once again, having a choice. And another defenseman of that Toronto Titans program. Yeah, he's, uh, you know, Robert is a big, tough defenseman. He, you know, he moves the puck, um, but you just don't want to play against him. I mean, he's, he is tough in front of the net. He's tough in the corner. As you see, he's 6'2", over 200 pounds, plays with an edge, and uh, you don't want to fool with him. And... You know, he's, he's, but gets the puck and moves it and stays at home. And again, he's the kind of guy that you're going to want on the ice uh, when you're up by a goal with a minute to go in the game and you got to kill a penalty. He's going to be on the ice. None of the three of us were goalies growing up, but I think uh, if we wanted to have a defenseman, he'd be one we want out there. He was, yeah, he was nasty to play against. You know, he's a prototypical stay-at-home defenseman, takes care of business in his own end. Um, like Tim said, moves the puck well, gets it up to forwards, let them do their job, but tough to play against. Went into a corner, and he looks like he, he hit to hurt when he went into the corners. Hi, my name is Robert Proner, a defense for the Toronto Titans. I'm from Prussia, Slovakia. What style of defenseman are you? A um, little bit of both, but mostly defensive. Do you uh, model your game after anybody? Uh, Chris Pronger a bit. What about Pronger's game did you like? Uh, I like that he's mean and really tough and uh, reliable for his coaches. What's been your favorite hockey moment so far? Uh, probably winning the Kraft Cup. Uh, it's a pretty magical night. Uh, I scored two goals and uh, uh, six five in OT. So and I got the OT winner. So it's pretty special. Who's had the most influence on your career? Um, probably my dad. Uh, just uh, always pushing me to be better and um, making sure I'm doing the right stuff to get there. Well, what will it mean when you hear your name called on draft day? Um, it'd be pretty special. Uh, I made a lot of sacrifices and saw my parents to be here, so uh, yeah, it'll be really special. The Saginaw Spirit is pleased to select with their second second round selection, 
Kirill Maximoff, Toronto Junior Canadians. Kirill Maximoff from the Toronto Junior Canadians minor midgets, the uh, latest choice of the Saginaw Spirit. Uh, well, you know, Krill has a lot of upside. I mean, he's got unbelievable hands. He's a good skater, good offensively, and he sees the ice well. As you can see, he's got some points. And, you know, when he's on his game, uh, there, he, he's very hard to control because he's, he, as you say, 6'1", 180, and he's got some good size and good speed. So, um, you know, when he, as I say, when he's on his game, he's, he's a top-notch player. You see there being able to uh, create some offense, both that shot you saw going stick side in the earlier highlight, but then trying to set things up, working up and down the wing, as that's the choice of the Saginaw Spirit. We'll stay in the West Division. The Saginaw Spirit is pleased to select with their third round selection, Brendan Bonello, Toronto Titans. I had a feeling this is the direction the Saginaw Spirit might go and, you know, with the Toronto Titans, the goaltender, we've seen the defense, we've talked a lot about the defense, a couple forwards. Now, Tim, the goaltender. Yeah, to me, uh, Brendan was probably the best goalie in the GTHL. Um, he had a very good defense in front of him, but, but still, uh, once you got by that defense, you, you had a big goalie who was uh, very mobile. Uh, good on, he was a very good skater, and he handles the puck extremely well and controls the rebounds. And uh, He was as dominating a goaltender as, as I've seen. And If a goal went in on him, it was either a tip or a perfect shot or... Uh, a broken play like that you didn't see too many you know bad goals going in off off this kid Brennan you know I got a chance to see him play a little bit doesn't look like a 15 year old goaltender he seemed to have that poise and that sort of that steady goaltending game yeah he did and you know one thing that you don't see especially with young kids is the ability he had to talk to his blue line he, he was t constantly communicating with them and that's one thing that you know you can even a coach at the junior level it's hard to teach kids to help them out. It's like a, he's being like a third defenseman back there because as Tim said, he handles the puck so well, but he's always letting his teammates know too if he's got time or quick up or he's always yelling and he's very focused in the game. And he, you know, he was also a member of Team Ontario and he started the tournament um, against Manitoba and Team Ontario got off to a little slow start and they were outplayed and outshot in that game and he was the main reason why they won that hockey game. Second off, Spirit is pleased to select with their third round selection, Cole Koski, Chicago Mission. Kowalkowski, the choice out of the uh, Chicago Mission program. Uh, Daryl, quick thought on him. Yeah, again, another kid that plays the game the right way in my mind. You know, doesn't take any shortcuts. Um, you know, battles, competes. Uh, played on a mission team that had a lot of skill. They were a very good skating hockey team, and he was a big part of that. They went to the national championships in Buffalo this year, um, and he was a big part of that. Just, just a complete type winger. Goes up and down, does his job, and makes the other team pay a price.